welcome viewers if still you're not subscribed to this channel kindly subscribe and also click the bell icon to get technology updates regularly on this jp infotech channel hi in this video we are going to see about a python project which is entitled as real time hand gesture detection for sign language recognition using python so before seeing the execution of the project tell me brief about this project we all know that people with the problem of deaf and dumb will be having the problem of communication so they will be using sign languages to communicate so in this project we are going to develop a real time hand gesture detection for sign language recognition using python so in this project we have done with the two models that is one with the real time using the web camera and uh, other one using the images so we will be uploading the images and the system will be detecting that image and it will be showing the what is the sign of that image that we have uploaded so in this way we have developed this and kindly note that we have used only five classes that is okay open hand peace thumb and no hand detected so it will be detecting only these classes and it is not going to detect all the things so in the existing system there there are system that detects the characters like a b c d like that but to overcome that and to pro to have a real time thing so we have done this model and uh, as i said you that we have done a two models so, so you will see the system architecture so first one is like a real time video for the web camera will be connecting and will be using the open cv to predict the results like whether it is a no hand detected okay open hand a uh, piece or thumb class and uh, other one we have developed using the exception architecture so our proposed model is uh, exception architecture where the image data set is used to trade and uh, from that image data set we'll be uh, we'll be using the test data to uh, we'll be uploading the data and we'll be checking whether the predicted result on this class that is no hand detected okay or open hand piece or thumb kind of thing and we'll be showing the performance analysis of it so in a uh, our proposed model we have used exception architecture and the training accuracy that we have achieved is 99.34 percentage and the validation accuracy that we have achieved is 99 percentage and uh, let me show you the exception architecture in the model we have used the data set so you can see this no hand detected so these are the data set images that we have used for the no hand detection which cost this does not contain any hand and for the okay you can see this is the images that we have used for the okay and next is the open hand so you can you can see the images for the data set images for the open hand part this is for the open hand part and for the piece class you can see this is the images that we have used to train up the system for the piece and final is the thumb class so you can see the images that we have used for the thumb class to train up the system so this is for the exception model we have used this data set and uh, now let us see the execution of the project so now before executing the project make sure that you have connected the web camera in your pc and make sure that you have fulfilled the requirement that is mentioned in the requirements file with the exact question of the python and the libraries on it so first let me show you the real time part so just go to the source code location and copy the source code location go to your command prompt type cmd and go to the source code location now type python and detect gesture dot py and click enter make sure your web camera is connected and now you can see the output that is it is showing the real time video from the web camera and here you can see the class that is no hand detected so i have I'm not showing any hand so it is showing the no hand detected so here you can see we have seen this no hand detected now and let us go for the okay part now so now you can see it is showing okay so this is for the okay okay part 
and next let me show you open hand this is for the open hand you can see the result for the open hand and you can see this tracking my hands and this is for the piece class this is for the piece class and the final is the thumb so as shown here in the architecture it is detecting open no hand detected ok open hand piece and thumb so you can check it again no hand detected thumb piece ok So now to close this just go to the command prompt and uh, press the key control C in the keyboard and you can close this. So now we have shown the real time part so now let us go to the our proposed model of exception architecture. So just go to the source code location and type python app.py and click enter. So now you can see the URL, just copy this URL, go to your browser, paste the URL. And now you can see the home screen or welcome screen of the project with the project title and capture recognition using deep learning. And you can see the login menu, just click this login menu. So it will be navigated to the login page and kindly note that this is a static login page because we have not used any database in the project. So just enter the default username and password as admin and admin and click login. So now you can see the login success message and click OK. Now it will be navigated to the preview part where you need to upload the image and you need to find the, the sign language of it. So just go to the uh, project source code location where you can find the upload file. You can check with the test case that is given or from the other thing also. Let me show you one by one. So first let me go to the thumb case and let me select any of the image. So let me click submit and now you can see the predicted result as thumb if you wanted to change it just go to the preview menu again let me select some other image also and then click submit and now you can see the predicted result as thumb so now let me go to the preview part again let me go to the other class and piece class let me show you this and let me click submit and you can see the gesture detected as piece correctly let me go to the preview part again and this time let me go to the next class that is open hand and let me click submit and you can see the predicted result is open hand and now let me go to the other class ok part and let me select it and give submit and now you can see the image that we are given and the printed result is OK. And if I am going to give the blank image without any hands. So here you can see it is no hand detector has been detected perfectly. So in this way you can give the data set images that we have given in the test folder or that with the data set that we have trained up with all these images from the train folder or test folder anything and you can find it maximum it will be detecting all very perfectly or in case if you wanted to download from internet and check it out so we'll do that also part right now so now let, so now let us take an any image from google and check it out so let me type ok sign language ok sign language and go to images and you can see there are various images let me save this image save as and let me type test and save it the desktop and now let me go to the project and go to the preview part let me select browse and it is a different format so it is not showing just me click all files let me select test and now you can see the image that we have downloaded from Google. It has been uploaded here and click submit. And now you can see it is detecting like OK. So in this way you can just also check with the data that is from the internet also. But uh, you need to select 
somewhat the thing that is accurate to that we have trained up with sometime it may show sometime it may not show we but there is a data set that we have trained up with it will be showing exactly so in this way you can check it out with the data that we have given up so now let me go to the final part that is the performance analysis part so this performance analysis part shows the performance analysis parameters like accuracy precision value recall value and f measure value and Finally, you can see the confusion matrix with the classes of no hand detected, OK, open hand, P's and thumb with the true label and the printed label of it. And let me log out. And this is all about the project real time hand gesture detection for sign language recognition using Python. And thank you for watching.